All right, Jake, here we go. I got the box set up. Um, I'm going to blink some stuff out so you don't see my messy room. There is the box set up with the background, and the camera, and back to my software. All right, what I did is here I'm using this edge of the box. Hopefully, as the box is coming down the conveyor, we could use the same idea. That'll be our internal treasure. And then I'm looking at three brightness spots on each side of the box, and I'll show you the logic in a minute. If I see anything that's bright on the side of the box, in the logic, I basically say that there's a left or a right side present, and if both sides are present, I'm going to fire an output, which is the one discrete, I'm sorry, the discrete output over here that I have tied to that, and I could show you that later on. Anyway, back to inspect my part. Right there, everything is looking good, and we've got a you know a good signal at this point. If I move the box to this side, it only sees one label, which is good. I detect the part, and sorry, we detect the part, and I see the label. However, the other side has none, so at this point we won't have an output. Go to this side. I detect the box, however, both sides do not have anything present, so the output will not be on. Doing it again to this side. It detects the corner of the box, sees the label, and I'm having a little bit of, there we go. Detects the box, two green spots, and getting back to the good side, two labels, we're good to go. All right. I'll try to get you something later on, but just want to give you a quick video of how it worked out. Thanks.